Hi everyone, Colin here and welcome back to another aquarium video. Today we're talking about feeding bottom feeding fish. And you'll see I keep all my dried aquarium fish foods in the refrigerator once they've been opened. And that just means they will keep fresher for a longer period of time. The bottom feeding fish will be given a range of foods that sink to the bottom of the aquarium. So there'll be tablets, there'll be pellets, uh, your fresh frozen foods will also sink down to the bottom. And in the fish kept in aquariums, many of the bottom feeding fish can come to the surface and eat with all the rest of the fish up at the top or in the middle of the aquarium water column. So for those bottom feeding fish who can feed everywhere, they will always get plenty of food and they will always do very well. So clown loaches, red tail sharks, and a number of fish with an underslung mouth are more than happy to come up to the top of the water to take food from anywhere. But there's also fish you'll have which never really ever leave the bottom. And so for those bottom feeding fish, sometimes the food can be all gone by the time that they find their way out to where the food used to be. So a very, very good tip to have for your other bottom feeding fish, the ones who stay only on the bottom, is to feed the aquarium and feed those fish after lights are out. So for this video, I've got lights on, obviously, so you can video and see what's happening. But I will put in some sinking foods, specifically for bottom feeding fish, once the lights have gone out, probably two to three times a week. It won't be every day, I'll still feed the tank as per normal every day. But when it comes to the bottom feeding fish, and in many cases for most people it could be Corydoras, it could be a whole range of other bottom dwelling fish that never leave the bottom, it's really worthwhile once, twice a week putting in some sinking foods, tablets or pellets that will drop straight to the bottom after lights are out. And most of the other fish in an aquarium, once the lights are out, they will generally settle down and not move around too much. Whereas true bottom feeders uh, are usually getting quite active once the lights are out. So those fish, Corydoras and others, will really get to go where the food is after dark once the lights are out. So there's a tip for you. Very, very good to feed every day for most of your fish, but once or twice a week, give an extra feeding after lights out to look after those bottom feeders. So I will leave you now to watch these guys having their pellets. At the end of a long day. I hope you've enjoyed watching my fish have a late night feed and if you've enjoyed this video please comment, share, leave a like and tell me what videos you would like to see coming up. Thank you so much for watching, I hope your tanks are going well. Till the next video, all the best to you all.